hi and uh, welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video we are going to be performing the kendall's w uh, statistical test the kendall's w statistical test is also known as kendall's um, coefficient of concordance so this is a non parametric test which means that it doesn't have any assumptions to be satisfied uh, with regard to the distribution of the data so uh, let's go ahead and perform the kendall's w statistical test to see what it's all about so here we have uh, data regarding the ranking of three different hospitals by four patients so these are the patients patient number one patient number two patient number three and patient number four so all these four patients have been to these three hospitals and they have ranked them accordingly so for example patient number one has ranked hospital number three as the best hospital he ranks it as number one and hospital number two is ranked as uh, the second best and hospital number one is ranked as um, the worst among the three and so uh, these are the ranks that the respondents have given so kendall's w will be used to find out which hospital is in fact the best hospital uh, in terms of ranking and also uh, whether the respondents agree to the rating as well so that's a more important thing so let's go ahead and perform the test uh, and find that out so uh, let's go and perform the test go to analyze and uh, select non parametric statistics in that select k related samples so k related samples uh, pull in all the three hospitals into the test variable column now by default friedman would be checked so you need to uncheck this friedman option and select kendall's w then click on okay so here you can see the output so from the output it's quite clear that the best ranked hospital by the respondents is hospital number 3 it's ranked 1.25 this is followed by the hospital number 2 which is ranked as 1.75 and the worst ranked is hospital number 1 it's th it's 3 so uh, so the best hospital according to the respondents is hospital number 3 and the kendall's w statistic tells us uh, how closely the respondents agree to this rating you know so uh, whether they really agree or not is seen by this statistic so according to one source anything uh, equal to or above uh, 0.6 is uh, considered uh, to indicate a strong agreement among the respondents so here we have a uh, kendall's w statistic of 0.81 so which means the respondents do strongly agree uh, with each other with regard to the rating so all of them agree to an extent to a great extent Uh, with regard to this uh, ranking so moreover you also look at the uh, significance level you can see the significance level as 0.039 which is less than 0.05 so the results are statistically significant at a moderate level so in the next part of the video we'll be looking at uh, interpreting this and data and uh, putting it in a paragraph uh, so that it's much easier to understand so um, the uh, results have been copied on to a, a word file and i put it in a table uh, and so the results are interpreted as follows based on the results observed in table 1 it can be said that hospital 3 was the best ranked hospital among the three hospitals while hospital 1 was considered to be the worst by the respondents kendall's w is greater than 0.6 uh, which is actually 0.81 in this case which indicates that the respondents strongly agree with this ranking furthermore the results have turned out to be statistically significant at a moderate level so you can see the significance level as i said it's uh, p is less than 0.05 thus the null hypothesis that there is no agreement among the respondents with regard to the ranking of the hospitals is rejected so they do agree to some extent uh, in fact to a great extent so uh, that's about it for this particular video i'll be uh, pasting the source uh, based on which you can actually interpret the uh the kendall's w statistic and there's a source for this and yeah so that's about it if you like my video please give it a thumbs up and if you like if you want more videos such as this one uh please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification icon uh so that you get notified whenever a new uh video is uploaded so thanks for watching and uh, bye for now